Hello and welcome back, royal fans. I'm Lucy, and today we have some intriguing news to discuss that revolves around the legacy of the late Princess Diana. It seems there's been a significant development regarding the access to Diana's discretionary fund for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Let's dive into the details. In a surprising turn of events, Cynthia Spencer, the sister of the late Princess Diana, has reportedly taken a rather unusual stance regarding the discretionary fund established by Diana for the benefit of her sons and their future families. According to recent information, Cynthia Spencer has seemingly prohibited Harry and Meghan from cashing out of Diana's discretionary fund until a certain condition is met. Upon Diana's untimely passing in August 1997, her estate held a net worth of around £21 million, which is approximately US$31.5 million. This sum encompassed various assets including funds, stock investments, valuable items like jewellery and clothing, and even a divorce settlement from Prince Charles totaling £17 million. Cynthia Spencer took charge of this discretionary fund, and it's interesting to note that she has seemingly set a condition for Prince Harry's access to this fund. The condition reportedly stipulates that Harry would only be able to cash out of the fund if he were to divorce Meghan Markle. Princess Diana's will outlined a comprehensive distribution plan for her estate. Her net worth, legally referred to as her estate, was to be divided among several individuals including her long-serving butler, Paul Borrell, her godchildren, and her two sons, William and Harry. The bulk of the estate was designated for William and Harry, who also inherited the discretionary fund. The intricacies of this discretionary fund point to its enduring nature. Initially established for Diana's sons and their future families, it has been managed by Cynthia Jane Fellows, Baroness Fellows, Diana's sister. Over the years, the fund has reportedly seen substantial contributions, including £100,000 and accumulated interest from its assets. Reports suggest that both Prince William and Prince Harry's marriages have led to an extension of this fund's beneficiaries. Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle are now able to benefit from it as well. This underlines the evolving nature of Diana's legacy and her intent to provide for her family. So, royal fans, there you have it, a rather unexpected twist in the story of Princess Diana's estate. Cynthia Spencer's decision to link access to the discretionary fund with Harry's marital status certainly adds an intriguing layer to the narrative. As always, the world of royalty continues to captivate and surprise us. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more updates on all things royal. I'm Lucy, and thank you for joining us today on the Royal Fans Channel.